Hello everyone, I am the practical mentor who gives you practical life hacks. This time, I am going to teach you how to multiply same two digit factors ending in 5 showing the usual long method and short method. Let's take 15 times 15. For the long method, 5 times 5 is 25. Write the partial product below the equal sign. Say 5 and then carry 2. Next, 5 times 1 is 5 plus 2 equals 7. The partial product is 75. For the next partial product, 1 times 5 is 5. Then, 1 times 1 is 1. Next, add both the partial products by bringing down 5. Then, 7 plus 5 is 12. Write 2, then carry 1. 1 plus 1 equals 2. The final product is 225. For the short method, we need to arrive at the same final product of 225 without going through the long process. Here it goes. 15 times 15. Multiply 5 and 5 and write immediately 25 below the equal sign. Then, the tens digits, which are both 1, think of a counting number that is next to 1. It is 2. Just multiply 1 and 2 to get 2. The final product becomes 225. Compare. Are they the same? Let's try 25 times 25. For the long method, 5 times 5 is 25. Write the partial product below the equal sign. 5, then carry 2. Next, 5 times 2 is 10. Plus 2 equals 12. The partial product is 125. For the next partial product, 2 times 5 is 10, where you will write 0 below 2 of the first partial product, then carry 1. 2 times 2 is 4, plus 1 becomes 5. Then, add both the partial products by bringing down 5, then 2 plus 0 is 2. 1 plus 5 equals 6. The final product is 625. For the short method, 25 times 25, we need to arrive at the same final product of 625 without going through the long process. Here it goes. Multiply 5 and 5 and write immediately 25 below the equal sign. Then the tens digits, which are both 2, think of a counting number that is next to 2. It is 3. Just multiply 2 and 3 to get 6. The final product becomes 625. Compare. Are they the same? Continue to watch and observe the two processes.
and for the next exercises, what are your answers?